Iggy and Scorch are back and ready to set anything and everything on fire. The inseparable pair have new toys stolen straight from Drongo's junkyard and are ready to turn up the heat. Iggy and Scorch return with their new and improved flame turret. These turrets now fire homing projectiles that Iggy and Scorch can direct with their basic attacks. You can only have four turrets up at a time, but that's more than enough to control large areas and make it difficult for enemies to bring you down. Burning Sensation will passively cause Iggy and Scorch's turrets and basic attacks to set enemies ablaze, dealing damage over time. Landing successful attacks will refresh the duration of the burn, and if enemies aren't careful, they'll be left with a strange burning sensation. Molotov allows Iggy to set an area on fire, dealing damage over time to enemies within the area of effect. Enemies standing in the flames will also have their ability armor reduced, allowing Iggy and Scorch to deal more and more damage over time. Molotov has great synergy with other casters, allowing their abilities to deal more damage. And finally, your ultimate is Blaze, and it kicks your turrets into overdrive. While active, your turrets turn into machine guns, dealing more damage, slowing enemies, and piercing through any enemies caught in their sights. When you're looking to cause mass chaos, throw down four turrets and kick it up a notch with Blaze. Iggy and Scorch excel at creating a strong defensive line and denying large areas. Keep in mind, enemies can easily destroy your turrets, so placing them strategically will allow you to get the most out of them and set everything on fire. Iggy and Scorch can be devastating in teamfights, especially if they have the time to set up. With a well-placed Molotov, you will increase not only your damage, but the ability damage your allies do as well. If you try to engage enemies without a strong defensive line, you will easily be extinguished. Get ready to set the world on fire as Iggy and Scorch.